New at 6 o'clock tonight, something happened at Texas A&M that we know parents here will want to follow. There are allegations of racial slurs being made by people on campus toward visiting high school students. Sarah Donchi is monitoring the campus controversy, and she joins us now from the Channel 2 newsroom. Sarah? Dominique, good afternoon. The story is getting the attention of top school officials, politicians, and it's sure to upset a lot of students and parents. Texas A&M is investigating after a group of visiting high school students were allegedly harassed and targeted because of their race. This is according to State Senator Royce West, who spoke with school officials. A group of 60 students from Uplift Hampton Preparatory in Dallas were visiting the A&M campus as part of a college tour. When West says a girl on campus walked up to them, showed the students her Confederate flag earrings, and started hurling racial slurs at them, including using the N-word. To have this happen uh, when some of these kids are doing what we want them to do, that is, uh, take a look at A&M to make a determination as to whether or not they want to attend. It was um, I, uh, like uh, I got hit over the head with a hammer. Strong words from that senator there. And Texas A&M President Michael Young sent a campus-wide email expressing his concern about the incident. He says the complaint is being investigated. Live in the newsroom, Sarah Donchi, KPRC Channel 2 News. Thank you, Sarah.